I developed probe halo just out of need of my own. One day I fat thumbed the number. I said negative five point instead of 0.5 and came down and bumped the body of it and decided that, man, if that would have crashed, that would have cost me big. So out of need of my own, I designed this halo to protect the probe body. And then of course, circled back to, well, if this helps me, this can help other people. Hi, I'm Pat Foreman. Welcome to my shop, Old Boys Industries. You might know me as Padded Old Boys from the internet. I got started, I got hooked up with a local Lorain County Community College. They started a new precision machining program. They had some Haas machines there. It was so cool. It was so futuristic. The technology was so cool to me that I knew I could make it work. And then I got a job at a, a local shop. I just caught onto it so quickly and it, it seemed like something that, you know, if I can do this here, why can't I do this on my own? Told my parents I needed to store something in their garage, so when the semi-truck pulled up and dropped off a super mini mill, they weren't too happy, but uh, that's, that's how I got my first machine. So my first couple jobs was just banging down doors. What, do you, what can I help you with? and then ran out of space, so ended up in this space. Picked up the VF4, picked up a VF2, and just keep growing from there. The, the niche I kind of found was either work that was so easy that other people didn't want, or work that was so difficult that other people didn't want. So kind of the onesie, twosie, one-off stuff. VF4 was huge for me for not only the size of parts, but also the amount that I could run on it. And for me specifically as a job shop, everything is, you know, wildly different setups. And that's been great for me to have. I can run six, eight, 10 different setups in different vices and stuff and just leave them on the table. So today on the VF4, I'm running intercooler end tanks for turbocharger setups. These are pretty unique because they're being machined with the connector on them. So it'll have Actually, the, this is a hydroflow clamp. We can do plasma clamps um, or a hose barb is machined into the tank instead of being welded on after the fat. It's a lot stronger and one less failure point. And especially for the customers, it's one less thing to weld, one less thing that the fabricators can mess up you know, on their end. And it looks better. They start out as about 50 pound billets, a 60-61. There's three ops on this particular tank about 40 minutes, 20 minutes, 20 minutes, and comes out, finished part, ready to go. Owning a shop's been a wild ride. I do love the part of being able to do my own thing. So being able to develop my own products, use my own creativity. Haas has been the perfect tool for me since day one. It's been bulletproof. They're easy to program, they're easy to run, they're easy to maintain. I most certainly see myself buying more. I mean, that's. That's, it's the machine for me, so.